um, get up, pray, make my bed, shower, fitness clothes, lay out my fitness stuff, my weights, my scroll, my mats, after workout, shower, and then I sit at my dining table and I do no filter. When I'm not doing no filter, housework, cleaning, <laughs> cooking, um, maintaining my home, getting to know my home that I treat it like a hotel basically because I'm never here. So that's been really great to connect with my home. Sometimes just really just sitting still. I'm fortunate that I can look out into the, I have the river. I treat myself. I either have some cookies, gluten-free cookies, or I've got a whole stash of English chocolate, meaning flakes, caramels, Twixes, um, galaxy bars, <laughs> um, dairy milk chocolate. So that's my little treat at night. I'm, I'm with my family at the minute. Um, so we've got each other and I've, I was I was just in one week's into rehearsals for a, for a job that hopefully I'll be doing after this, a film called Wolf by Natalie and B, B and Cherry. And uh, so just kind of trying to use this time as best as possible to, obviously we're not physically all together as a crew and a team in the rehearsal process as we would have been, but there's a lots of work that kind of that first week put us in good stead to kind of open a couple of doors of discoveries that we can that can keep mining on my own and you know keep speaking to Natalie over the phone and just try and use this time as to be both productive and also it's you know to, to be with my family as well like it's kind of just trying to do the best with suddenly being given all this time which is yours to do with what you will trying to bake um I have been with my son a lot um we have bonded, bonded in, in such a way where I just feel like this was time for me with him and my husband, for us to just have this time together to just see each other. Well, we haven't sat still in our um, home state of Tasmania for quite some time. I'm living with my father who's elderly and you know I'm trying to protect from danger <laughs> um so uh we are doing a massive massive spring clean which is um, an autumn clean really here um which is quite confronting as well because my mother passed away so I am going through all of her things and finding her handwriting and photos everywhere so it's it's a stressful time because it's, it, I feel the fear. I find myself doing things like laundry and <laughs> because my staff is, you know, so I, and cooking is like working out, you know, um, after a while, it just kind of comes back, you know, and I, so I ended up just, just starting to cook. And then after you start cooking, you start to get creative when you start to remember how to do it. I was like, oh, maybe I add this and maybe I add that. And then you say you're cooking for one person, but really it's not. And then you make these portions really big and then you have to eat it because you made it. And then after a while, you just start getting fat. <laughs> so it's, it's this whole process that's going through that you'd be like, oh man, really? Uh, so it, it hasn't been bad, you know. It's me just doing whatever I can. It's crazy for me because I'm used to getting up at six in the morning. I get up, I'm, I'm on the set at seven, you know, on a regular basis. And I'm a hustler, so if I don't hustle every day, I, I get physically sick. I used to get sick if I don't hustle. And I'm an older cat, so this working is keeping me alive. Now, I'm sleeping till like 10, 11 o'clock. I'm waking up, I'm walking downstairs real slow. I realized quickly that I make my money in front of crowds. So I lost a big tour this summer, you know, like 35 shows to be honest you know what i'm doing with my time of course we were so blessed to have miss rita wilson's tom hanks wife uh she got diagnosed with covid and you know when she was quarantined in australia she you know remembered uh hip-hop parade she had to re remember it for a movie role so she went viral with our song um and since then, I mean, we've been running like crazy. I've never done a Zoom video in my life. And in the past week, I'm probably on my 10th one now. So it's been like a, a liquor de detox. You feel what I'm saying? Getting on that grind. And then just basically all other projects and everything else that was too busy to do and running a thousand miles an hour. I look like this a blessing to slow and sit everybody down.
and you could really concentrate on your trade and, and what you was doing before. I just been working out, Tres, you know, trying to stay fit, man, trying to stay sane. You know, yeah. you it, it, listen, Tres, we've been we've been in the PIM, so it's like this is this is this is like nothing for me to be in this type of confinement. Uh trying to hide from my wife and four kids. Uh, you know, you're getting to know yourself pretty well. You know, you catch up on all those things like cleaning your closet and reading a book. But, you know, like everyone else, you're trying to do the right thing. And the right thing is to stay in and stay out of harm's way. And uh, and that's the way that all of us can do something to help this COVID go away. You know, we love to cook. So we've been cooking a lot. And uh, we like the challenge of um, trying to figure out what, what's just in the, what's lying around the pantry and make something good from it. Uh, we've been playing a lot of music. Um, you know, we have a lot of instruments around the, around the house. Um, uh, you know, I have to get into, to be honest with you, I have to get into a groove because for the past week, I've just sort of sat here. I've just sort of sat here. So I know I, I, I have to get into a groove of something. And right now I ain't got no groove. No, I don't have one. I don't. I'm, I'm very fortunate. I'm, here at my ranch with my family, we're making good use of our time, getting uh, the grounds ready for, you know, we have a real hot summer up here, so we have a lot of fire potential, so we're spending a lot of time getting the, the brush all picked up, and uh, and so, yeah, but if I sit there and dwell on it, I think that it just becomes overwhelming.